hello everyone welcome back to my channel today I'm going to be showing you how to insert grommets into the rucksack bag here I have my grommets I have eight and I also have the pins where these pins fall they mark the center where I'm going to be making the circles or the holes so here you have the grommet set this set that I'm going to be using is a half inch set. Now I bought this set off Amazon. Now these sets come in three parts. So here you have this part usually goes on to the board. This also came with it. You place it on here. This is the part that you use to actually make the holes as I said earlier and this is the part that you're going to be hitting with the hammer to sink the grommets in now this is how a typical grommet looks you have different types of grommets these are the ones I'm going to be using this is the protruding part and this is the part that is usually seen so this is the one that you put on top and this is the one that will be going underneath usually after you cut the holes you put this here you put the fabric over the bottom part then you place this part have a look at it so the part that is pushed up is going to be on top then you put this over here you hit it with a hammer and it would be nice to go in a circular um, motion only because that will help it to even it out so they all go down at an even pace and fold properly now I'm going to get myself a hammer I'm also going to mark all the holes and I'm going to be showing you how I mark all the holes now as you can see I made a little mark here and here now that's basically where the bottom of the so I'm going to be starting the bottom from here so I know where I'm going to make the mark now what I'm going to do is just make the impression of the circle and then I'm going to use a scissors and cut it out because these fab fabrics are a bit stiff so that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to make that circle. And I'm making another little one right here. Then I'm going to go ahead and cut that out. And then I'll show you the next step. Okay, so as you guys can see, I just pushed them through. Now, the next thing that I'm going to be doing is to get these in. Now, I'm not going to be nailing these. I'm not going to be knocking, I should say, on my machine desk. So, I'm just going to show you guys, do a demonstration of what I'm going to be doing. Now, as you can see, how I place these in. So this is the pretty side. This is the side that is going to be facing up 
where you're gonna be seeing so you turn it this way getting that down here so this is always gonna look that so the material is on in the middle now this is how you're gonna be placing it over it. so the part that has the you can see it the part that has the smooth texture that is the part that is gonna be on top have a better look okay and we're gonna be using this part of it and you're gonna be hitting it with a hammer but you it, it's always better to rotate it a little bit while you're hammering it to get to get this part the part this part to fall over on itself evenly so I'm gonna do a little demonstration but mind you I'm not gonna be doing them on my machine desk but I'm gonna let you guys see the finished product All right Okay, so I just finished putting them in, and this is how they look. No. This is the part that's not going to be shown, and this is the part that is going to be showing. Now I'm just going to slip my string on in, and I'm good to go. Okay, you guys, so you can see I just finished putting my string through. So yeah I'm gonna show you how my bag looks when it's finished okay okay you guys so this is what my bag looks like when it's finished so I'm going to unbutton so you can see how it looks very windy but yeah that's it yep <laughs> welcome back to my channel today I'm going to be showing you how to insert a bobbin into a singer industrial sewing machine 